The Benefits of Covered Wounds There is a popular belief that airing out a wound in order to form a scab is good. Acting as nature's bandage and signaling that the healing has begun. This is in fact not true. Let's see why. In healthy skin, cells are made of mostly water and can only survive in the moist environments underneath the skin surface. When a wound occurs, cells that were once protected from air exposure will dry out. Like fish, without moisture, the cells cannot move around and they will eventually die. Important components that would help heal your wound dry out too. The scab that results is an accumulation of dead cells, dried blood, and various proteins. As the scab expands and hardens, it literally creates an obstacle for cells responsible for repairing your skin to move and grow. Because they cannot survive in dry conditions, these cells will not grow over nor into the scabbed area. Instead, they are forced underneath the scab. This extra distance increases the amount of time your wound takes to heal. Think about it as taking a detour rather than driving directly to your destination. The scab is the detour. Scabs are not nature's bandages. After an injury to the skin, a wound covering should be used to create an optimal healing environment. A moist environment, such as the environment under a protective covering, promotes growth and movement of new cells and ensures that essential components for closing your wound can get where they need to go in order to do their repair job. When a wound is covered, the injured area is not only protected from drying out, but also protected from dirt and germs. As you can see, the wound is able to heal much faster and more effectively in the absence of scabbing. In essence, you are creating the best environment for your skin to become healthy again.